21 award-winning animal photos. Number 21, Hitchhikers. This vibrant, colorful depiction of a lion's mane jellyfish won as the overall winner in the British Wildlife Photography Awards for 2016. The photographer is named Joe Stoll, who snapped the beautiful iconic image while in the St. Killa off the island of Hirta, located inside Scotland. Number 20, Dancing Shrimp in Formation. The international mackerel runner-up for the Underwater Photographer of the Year in 2015 went to Teresa A. Geis from the United States for this brilliantly colored snapshot of some deep sea shrimp. This image was obtained when the artist went on a dive site mooring, which is essentially a big concrete block, which was covered in pink sponge. Number 19, The Moon and the Crow. Gideon Knight was a United Kingdom winner of 2016's Young Wildlife Photographer of the Year with this captivating image. As the light blue sky fell over the horizon and the faded golden disk of the moon rose, the black feathers of a crow stationed itself inside the dense dark branches of a tree inside London's Valentine Park, creating this atmospheric view. Number 18, Pink-Footed Geese in Mist. The picture of these geese traveling through icy tundra a frost-driven winter as they fly single file in order to migrate to warmer climates won the British Wildlife Photography Awards in the black and white category. The photographer, Cher Whittaker, took this stunning image in the highlands of Scotland along what is called the Black Isle. Number 17, Fennec Little Ghost of the Dunes. Wow, here's a cute one. This photo won the Fritz Polking Nature Photography Prize back in October of 2015. Phoenix are small nocturnal foxes found in the Sahara of North Africa. They are best characterized by their distinctive large ears and soft golden white fur. The Italian-born photographer Bruno Damix is the person who took this stunningly beautiful photograph. Number 16, Roe Deer in Four Seasons. From 2015's British Wildlife Photography Awards, the overall winner for September was this beautiful snapshot of a rural female deer hidden inside the dense red haze of flowers known as Poppy Field, located in Suffolk, England. The photographer's name was Kevin Sawford, and I'm pretty sure that the deer's name is Bambi. Number 15, A Well with a Mouthful. From the year 2015, this breathtaking photograph took home the first place award for the Wildlife Photographer of the Year in the underwater category. The Australian native photographer Michael Ah captured this stunning image just off the coast of Australia's southern edge. A bright well tears through the ocean waters, rips straight through the swirling mass group of sardine fish, gulping down a humongous mouthful of these tasty critters in a single well-timed pass. Number 14, Mystical Tawny Owl. These stocky medium-sized owls can typically be found inside the woodlands across most of Eurasia, the combined landmass of Europe and Asia. These strange yet beautifully colored owls are non-migratory and highly territorial. Jan Picha took home the GDT Nature Photographer of the Year back in April of 2015 with this breathtaking hidden away bird in the quiet forest of Munich, Germany. Number 13, Polar Bear Plunge. This stunning photo of a polar bear diving jaws first into a frozen Arctic sea won third place in the International Picture of the Year for the Science and Natural History subdivision. The photographer is Jeffrey F. Bill, who won works for the Baltimore Sun and snapped this astounding primal shot inside of the Maryland Zoo, which is the third oldest zoo in the United States and averages over 400,000 visitors annually. Number 12, Chameleon. This charming green colored reptile won third place in the World Press Photo Awards as part of the stories category in 2016. Photographer Christian Segler managed to capture a juvenile two-banded chameleon climbing along inside a recently burned field. His beady reptilian little eyes seem zoomed in on that approaching camera lens. Those scales really pop with the light coloring of the lizard's skin in comparison to the dismissal mostly brown background surrounding it. Number 11, Piercing Headache. The overall winner of the Aging Nature Photographer of the Year Award in 2016 went to this gorgeous photograph and the proud photographer Matthew McIntosh. An orange-eyed tree frog is visited by some unwelcome guests, mosquitoes on a quest for their next meal, which is crucial for future egg development of their species. This image was shot in Cedar Bay National Park, which resides inside Queensland, Australia. Number 10, Taken in My Back Garden. The overall winner for the GDT European Wildlife Photographer of the Year for 2015 went to Richard Peters for this thought-provoking silhouette of a fox. The image is a shadowy cast by an urban fox out on its nightly patrol. The camera was placed high enough to feature the neighboring house to add framing and a 30-second exposure helped capture the night skyline and twinkling stars. The camera was triggered by a light barrier sensor when the fox strode past. 
Number 9. Ruffs on display. For aspiring photographers from the younger generation, this intriguing photograph won Young Photographer of the Year for ages 11 through 14 in 2015. The photographer who hails from the Czech Republic is named Andres Pelanek, or at least that's how I think it's pronounced, on their traditional lekround, an area of vast tundra located on Norway's Varenja Peninsula. These two territorial male ruff birds in full breeding plumage show off their ruffs to each other in this mating ritual in which the animals proclaim ownership of their courtship areas. Number 8. Arctic Water Dance That humpback whale starts center stage in this beautiful imagery. Adun Ricardson took home the overall winner of the Fritz Poking Prize for GDT's Nature Photographer of the Year in 2016. The playful humpback was swimming on the coast of Norway just before it began its migration into the southern base latitudes. Number 7. Goosender Family This adorable mother goose with her ducklings in tow shot from above is gorgeous as well as heartwarming. This stunning work of color, natural light, and of course, starring Mother Nature's Natural Beauty won the German Photographer of the Year award in the GDT Nature Photography Contest in 2016. Number 6. Land of Nothingness This photograph of a white rhino won M. Levine the Professional Landscape Category Award for the Sony World Photography Awards in 2016. Namibia is one of the least densely populated places in the whole planet, a barren yet constantly changing desert landscape. Number 5. Sheep Stampede This snapshot from Mother Nature won the Award of Excellence in the International Pictures of the Year competition for science and natural history. From photographer David Guttenfelder and his work with the Associated Press, this photograph showcases a large flock of sheep blocking a once landslide covered roadside deep inside the mountains of the Kashmir region located in Pakistan, and shows the woolly animals fleeing in terror after a 7.6 magnitude earthquake which decimated the area. Number 4. Proud Mama This stunning photograph by Michael O'Neill took home second place in National Geographic's Nature Photographer of the Year in 2016. Fry of a peacock bass tend to hover around their mothers for protection from unsavory predators. Peacock bass are known for exercising excellent parental care and will protect their young with their very lives against any threat which there comes in between them and their offspring. This tropical species housed from South America and was intentionally introduced into Southern Florida during the 1980s in an attempt to control African tilapia, another highly invasive species of fish. Number 3. Intruder This charming photograph took home the runner-up prize for the GDT's European Wildlife Photographer of the Year Award in 2015. Warmat Zubaski of Germany took the award-winning shot in a green German lake amongst tiny water snails. The American crayfish is an invasive species. It was introduced to Central Europe from North America sometime near 1890 and not only drives out the local crayfish species in devastatingly large numbers, but also passes on a crayfish plague which it is immune to. This image is meant to make people People think about further conservation efforts for dwindling crayfish population. Number 2. Orangutans are more like us than you think. In 2016, this image was the grand prize winner of the Wildlife Photographer of the Year competition, which had a record-setting 50,000 entries from 95 separate countries around the world. Taken by photographer Tim Laman, the snapshot shows a boring orangutan climbing a strangler fig, which has entwined itself around a tree in Gunang Palung National Park, which can be found in Indonesia. This world-class artist spent three full days of climbing up and down with ropes in order to get this award-winning picture. Tim hopes to bring attention to the critical endangerment of the Sumatran and Bornean orangutans. Number 1. In February of 2015, this extraordinary piece of photography took home the Underwater Photographer of the Year Award. Nuno Sa from Portugal is responsible for this beautiful up-close look at a seahorse taken in the Algarve, a national reserve of Rio Formosa. This underwater world is home to the planet's biggest population of the two species of seahorses, which can be found inside the Mediterranean and Atlantic Oceans. Unfortunately, the local university aligned with Project Seahorse has discovered that there has been a registered 85% decline in wildlife seahorse population between 2001 and 2009. Each year, 50 tons of seahorses are captured to be put in aquariums and chopped up to be used in traditional Asian medications. Captive breeding can possibly relieve some of the pressure, hence the choice of the name for the photo, which will hopefully make this world take notice.